of the objects on the blackboard. No yeah. child should be left out of school is the aim of government and partners, including Child Fund, working for a greater future. This is Madine Tunyang, a remote community in the Central River Region South, one of the beneficiary schools of the Zero Out of School concept or project, of which Child Fund is a solid partner. However, the Zero Out of School concept is still far from reality in this community. The Zero Out of School project is taking shape in Medina Tunjang, one of the rural communities where Western education is perceived in negative lights around Islam. One Aminata boy is said to be the only native of the community who completed school at least for now. She is going to the Gambia College and currently on her second year teaching practice in her native village. Man kena mane ka di dem school, ni janko ante meti bu bari I was the only one going to school in the village and it was very difficult for me because in this village people believe Western education is not Islamic. At some points in time it turned to be a stigma to me and my father. Since inception three years ago, the number of students in this school stands at 246. Kujari M. Jabi is a teacher posted in this school. His yet efforts are continuing to improve enrollment and retention. It's not an easy village or a community, I must say, because they are not that much in good conversation with uh, Western education. So enrolling their children was a bit difficult. So the coming of the project actually motivated some to bring their kids to school. In Bantunding, Upper River region, the Zero Out of School project is gradually changing the narratives thanks to child fund support, providing stationery and bicycles for the students. We have done our very best to talk to the parents about the importance of education. We used to have meetings with the PTA, that is the Parent Teachers Association, with the SMC, that is the School Management Committee. So we are able to uh, have some little bit of um, increase, improvement. On the side of retention is also our problem, because many a times some of these children, when they come here, we register them. When there are social gatherings, they, are, they always go with their parents. When we ask for them, they would say they, he has gone for some social activities and others will be transferred to, to the combos, either for married purposes or other things. I am also happy the, uh, the idea that child phone is coming with because with that, it is going to help children to come back to school. Here, the classroom blocks and toilet facilities are fitted with ramps to accommodate children with disabilities. The impact assessment tour continues in other parts of the country. Ibrahim Ajal, GRTS News.